Dinosaurs. Everyone knows that they're really, really old and everyone knows that they weren't that lucky when it came to life on Earth. But what if I told you that there are creatures living amongst us right now that are even older, that were around long before our giant dinosaur friends? And what if I told you that they were sharks and rays? Would you want to know more? Good. Well, it turns out that this time they've gathered a pretty impressive CV. They've survived five mass extinctions starred in feature films and being nominated for the best picture. So it's difficult to imagine that right now they're facing their sixth mass extinction, with a quarter of all sharks and rays currently threatened, and mainly because of us, overfishing. In 2010, 97 million sharks and rays were killed. That's double the UK population, and 97 million too many, of course. So what are biologists like me doing about it? We're finding out just how much of an impact overfishing is having and can have on future sharks and rays. And what do we need to do that? Well, a toothbrush really. No, we're not going to give their pearly whites a clean. Instead, we can use a toothbrush to collect DNA from their skin. Minimal disturbances for them and we get to keep our fingers. Their DNA not only gives them a lot of information, but also gives us information too. From it, we can see if their gene pool is becoming more of a puddle. We can see if their choice of potential mates is genetically varied enough. And we can see that if that's not the case, the risks this might cause in the future. And if the research we are carrying out can prove that overfishing is the main contributing factor, we can influence the world to make a difference. My name is Samantha Hook and I'm a PhD student at the University of Manchester.